Please, I go to Mandy Drury at the Breaking News Desk. Mandy. Yeah, absolutely. I'm just getting the press release here from Moody's to give you some more detail. As you've been, of course, uh, announcing, Melissa, that Moody's, the ratings agency, has uh, placed the AAA bond rating of the United States government on review for possible downgrade, giving what they see the rising possibility that the statutory debt limit will not be raised on a timely basis. In other words, not by the deadline of August the 2nd, which would lead to a default of U.S. Treasury debt obligations. Now, they also go on to say, Melissa, that they consider the probability of a default on interest payments to be low, but still it is something that they absolutely cannot ignore. They also say because this type of default is expected to be short-lived and therefore the expected loss to holders of treasury bonds, for example, to be minimal or even non-existent, uh, the rating would most likely be downgraded to somewhere in the double A range. Um, it is also worth noting that Moody's has also placed on review for possible downgrade the AAA ratings of financial institutions that are are directly linked to, to the U.S. government. For example, you have Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, um, the federal home loan banks and also the federal farm credit banks. So, you know, obviously this is incredibly important news and as we have seen the market reaction as well with the, with the push down in the U.S. dollar. I think uh, U.S. dollar and euro uh, is, is a really interesting to one to watch. It's up by 1.6% for the euro-U.S. dollar cross. Back to you. All right, Mandy, thanks so much for that.